Hey everyone, me Phone here on Senate Beast. This is the Stanley Cup Playoffs of the Conference Semifinals, and we're back here once more. We finished here for the Western Conference, a great Canadian team matchup of the Oilers and Flames, and they now have the 2-0 advantage for Calgary here for tonight, and we'll be back here at Edmonton for the next game in Game 3 and 4. Right now, we're about to show you the next game. It's the New York Rangers and Carolina Hurricanes. Hurricanes got a great start here in Game 1, but can they do it the second time? Well, we'll find out if there is a changeup that they can try to hit their way off target. Now, let's send you over to PNC Arena, along with the other crew of Jay Sabolski and Greg Ferraro, here for the commentator crews, here for the NHL of EA Sports. And the two of you, let's get started here with the game, the next one here in the Eastern Conference matchup. Canes have one nothing lead, and we'll see how well they do here for the second game. Guys, it's all yours. I'll be back here for the post-game show after the regulation period is over. We'll see you guys later after three period completion. remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Wait. 
through the entire team, head up, looks at his options, decides he's the best option, and finishes it off. New York goal. His first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 23, Adam Fox. Time and a goal, 436 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. New York's got possession here in the offensive zone. The Rangers gain possession. Manages to hang on. Carolina's got control of the puck. Takes the feed. Takes it to the net. There's still lots to go. Erkate's goal! His first goal in the playoffs, scored by number 20, Sebastian Aho. And his first second assist here by number 86, Terry Turning. Time to go, 5.46 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. here by number 20, Evan Bear, and by number 21, Carbon Nidrunner. Time of the goal, 7.33 remaining in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Anderson 
Anderson's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Panarin's able to move his feet and fire pucks at the same time. His make and snappy zone ability is that quick shot while moving in stride, and it's how he likes to create scoring chances. Ajo's third eye zone ability means he can distribute the puck so well. I'll be keeping tabs on these players all night long, and let's see if one of them can lead their team to victory. Guys, back to you. Quick feed to Ajo. Lindgren's got it in the defensive end. Pushes it across to Kreider. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Steps inside the line. There's a hit on the play. The Hurricanes move the puck in the defensive zone. Takes the feed ahead from the left side. Puts it on net. That's blocked by Shusterkin. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. The Rangers take possession off the faceoff. Truva's moving the puck through his own zone. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh, stick save and a beaut. Yeah, I hate it when I miss chances like this, James. You don't get many that are this quality. You want to put them away because you don't know when the next one's going to come. And there's a blocker stopped by Shesterkin. The Rangers have it behind the net. Here's a short pass to Strom. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. Takes the pass. Gains the zone through the middle. And now he tries to get it across to Natchez. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. New York's got the puck. Quick pass across to Panarin. Here's a shot. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Good technique as the puck is over to the corner out right of the way. He was locked in there. The Hurricanes move it in. Here he is, wrists it on net. Turns it aside with a glove. Here in the late going to the frame, 3-1 is where we're sitting. Fans being treated to a lot of offense thus far. The Hurricanes win it. Taken by Pesci. Stones him in front. Puck is frozen and will get a face off. Speaking of us here, to joining us tomorrow, we will have the Avs and the Wilds along with the other two. Ajo's won the draw here in the offensive zone. The oh, puck doesn't get there. It's so crowded in front of the goaltender. Nice zone entry on the left side. A shot! The Panthers and the Capitals. Picked up along the wall by Hito. He scores and serves up a trick at it. I don't know why goalies don't make sure that bottle isn't locked in there. That would really make me sour to see the bottle go up in the air. Both teams are said they're ready to drop the puck. New York goal is first goal of the seat in the playoffs. Scored by number 49, yeah, Brian Hunt. His first assist here by number 52, Brian Stroh. And by number 72, Brian Hito. Time of the goal, 1643 remaining in the third first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs.
covers things up. Still lots of time left here, but the clock is winding down. Carolina's won the face off. Oh, absolutely rocks them. He's a power forward. That's a big part of his game. He really threw a big hit. The hurricane scooping up along the boards. And nearing the final 60 seconds of this opening stanza. Last minute remaining in the first period. Once again. Second goal of the playoff score by number 88, Martin Nakas. His first assist here by number 74, Anthony Slavin. And by number 4, by Trocek. Top of the goal, 19, 33 remaining. Their first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. First goal in the playoff score by number 17, Schwitzen Trocek. And by number 24, Slevin. Time of the goal, 19, 30, 55 remaining in the first period. Wow, this play was a disaster one. But what a huge blowout here for the first period. The Rangers got only two and five for Carolina. We'll take a quick break here when we come back. Time now for the second period. Back to you guys. Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, is also set. Let's do this. Set to get underway here in the second period. We'll see if they can stop the bleeding. Ray, what's your assessment of the game at this point? Carolina's tactics were perfect in that first period. They had the puck the whole time, and they had lots of luck around the net. The Rangers gain possession in their own end. Maintains possession. Carolina's gain possession along the boards. From center, they get into the attacking area. The Rangers look to start the transition game. And now he angles it across to Kreider. New York's across the blue line. Fires it. Oh, that goes awry. And they create the scoring chance, and it's a good one, but they don't get it on the net. Battle along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Slavin. Great defensive effort with the stick. New York's got the puck behind the net. Right to the middle. Here's a shot. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Anderson's been sharp stopping the puck tonight. He's got a really good save percentage, and his team's done a good job in the offensive zone as well. The Rangers gain possession along the wall. Nice zone entry from the middle. Quick pass to Fox. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Well position save, and he has the rebound over in the corner. Jarvis gains the zone. Shot, and the puck fakes off the glove. Scrum ensues along the boards. Grabs the puck in the slot. Misses. Get it on the cage. Make the goalie do something with it. Strong's got the puck along the wing. Here's a chance. Kicked away. Corner. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. Into the offensive end now. A chance! Long jam in front, that's broken up. Looks to set up at the point now. Picked up along the boards by Nietzsche's. And that was stopped. The Rangers take it across the blue line. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Anderson. 
More than half the period left to play. The Hurricanes have been the better squad so far tonight. They lead it 5-2. Back underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Crammed along the boards by Hito. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. And the goalie now steps behind his net to play the puck. Miller's got it behind his own net. Carolina's run a big number up on the scoreboard here. They've controlled this game from the very first moment. And he regains control of the puck. Takes it right in the chest. And we're going to get a stoppage here as the referee blows the play dead. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. The Hurricanes win the faceoff. On the attack along the boards. New York's got a hold of the puck now. And a stick break setup. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Pesci's loving the puck. Along the right wing, the edge of the attacking area. New York's got possession of the puck. Hello! James, I honestly feel the boards rattle when those hits are on my side of the ice. Anderson's opted to hang on to the puck for a face-off. on his status. Pass to Miller. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Panarin. Slides the puck over. Oh, a clutch save! The Hurricanes gain control of the puck. Tries to get it over to D'Angelo. Enters the offensive zone from the left. And puts the body into a little bumper car hockey. Blacks it into the offensive zone. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. What's some open space at center. Fires it on net. Stops the rocket of a shot. He got all that hit. Here's a shot. Turned aside by the goaltender. Taken along the wall by Goodrow. Denies him again. But score is in. He gets a hold of his own rebound. Count the second time. The Rangers seem to have shaken off that funk here, Ray. They had to get going a lot better than they had earlier in this contest. Now down by two. New York goal. His first goal in the playoffs. Scored by number 56, Ryan Schroh. His first assist here by number 21, Barclay Goodwill. And by my number, my number 20, Chris Craig. Time to go. 16 40, 42 remaining in the second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Trail by a pair. 
There's a shot. Oh, he rocked him. Some players have more of a physical presence. He does have one, and he really used his size to his advantage. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. Stalls won the draw. Slides it back to the blue line. A spirited battle along the boards to the pop. Moves it to the front of the air. Handles the saucer pass beautifully. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Picked up along the wall by the front of the air. No one home on that play. Turned aside. The Hurricanes gained possession. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. Carolina's moving it into the offensive end. And the officials will pass the sentence here. The Rangers are getting... New York penalty, number 20. Two minutes for interference. Two minutes for our slashing, Chris Crowder, number 20, for New York Rangers. Time of the penalty, 15-42 remaining in the second period. It is a Carolina Hurricanes power play. Strong's 
What a big draw on their own end. Through center along the wing. Hangs onto the puck. Goodrow stick handling in his own zone. Gets the puck in deep. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Panarin. Puck scooped up by Strom. And it's kicked away. Scrum along the boards. They battle for the puck. One minute remaining in the second period. They are smoking it. Can the Hurricanes win the second game? We'll find out right after the break. Stick around later for the third period coming up after this. Alright, only one period to go. Let's give it a finish. They're ready to drop the puck on period number three. He's Ray Perot. I'm James Sabolski. Let's do this. Here we go. Third period set to get underway. Point. Carolina's focus now is just locked down this game. Comfortable lead. They've been terrific through 40 minutes. Don't give it away now. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. New York's won the draw. Lindgren's got the puck through the neutral zone. Carolina's got a hold of it against the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Great puck check on the reach. Into the attacking end. Here he is, shot right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. They came out and challenged a good save. Win the draw. 
Nice toss. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Fires it into the offensive zone. Carolina's got a hold of it along the wall. Penalty coming up here. Ah, I hate to see this. That play's going to result in... New York penalty, number 21. Two minutes for, for roughing. On court's home game, misconduct. Another chance here on the man advantage. Just because the power play hasn't had a success run here, you can't focus in on that. You can't try to do too much. Brooklyn good roll for a two-minute penalty for a game misconduct here. Time of the penalty. Six for... 4.43 remaining here in a third period. Here now will be Cairns Power Play. And uses the length of a stick to knock that puck away. And he says no. He scores. Well, they've been hoping that the extra work they've done on the power play would help them capitalize. They do a nice job there. The Hurricanes see Hurricanes goal! A second goal of the playoffs in a power play. Number 86, Tuvo Terminen. His assisted by number 17, Vince Churchill. Time to go. 5.15 remaining in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs in the power play.
just one goal in the five minutes. Sometimes the penalty killers just do a great job, but they're able to get one up on the board. Shot! And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Post it quickly over to the air. Makes a move in front! Stopped by the goaltender. Excellent chance. They work the puck into position, and it's a scoring chance that's turned away. Fantastic stick saved by Anderson. Smothered that in close chance. Both setters ready to take the draw here coming up. The Hurricanes win the draw. Moves the puck. Slavin's got it into offensive territory. The Rangers get a hold of the puck along the boards. This is point night. Everybody, it seems, is on the board with either a goal or an assist. And since it's not over, even if you don't have one, you've got a chance still. This game is going to have goals right until the final horn. Takes it to the net. He's got the yards. Deuces wild for him now. Well, that makes you right. I'll tell you, it's great to score one. You get a second one. It's such a rush. Hurricanes goal and second goal of these playoffs. Score by number 20, Sebastian Ajo. His first assist by number 37, Torvald Schnudzikov. And by number, number 17, Vincent Torchek. Time of the goal, 15-42 remaining in a third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. So a correction, 12. 1242 remaining in a third period. Now it's 13 remaining to go. Over to Stahl. Oh, he stops him with a block. Great, great 
flexes there. Still much time left to go. And keep your eyes tuned for tomorrow's game, too. The Hurricanes win it. And now it's grabbed by Cole. Centering pass. And that's broken up. Now Puck doesn't get to the net. Good positioning by the defender. Gains the zone from the right side. Puts it on net. Turned aside with a glove by Anderson. Along the wing up the neutral zone. The Hurricanes played along the boards. Carolina's got possession here in the offensive zone. Georgiev's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Lots of time left here, but the time is running out. The Last run. minute remaining in a third period. Final minute of regulation here, and it should be it. Locked in traffic. Up along the wing. Here's a chance. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. And he denied that opportunity. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Carolina's got the puck inside the defensive zone. They go on the attack from the left side. Denied by the puck stopper. Taken by Lindgren. The Rangers take it along the wing. Here's a shot. Shot down by the blocker. Cole's gaining momentum. Here's a chance. Makes the save. What a tremendous run. The Hurricanes sweep out the Rangers 8-3. A tremendous block and ultimately a stop down, smack down, and in between his rally point. Now it's time to bring the three star players of the game. Thank you guys for joining us here for game two. The first star goes out to Seth Jarvis. His first goal, three assist and two hits. That's his first goal in the playoff game. What a tremendous score. Number two, we have is Tuvo Teravanian. Two goals, two assists, and three hits. A tremendous one. Making it safe, make a comeback in there. And for number one, this one goes to Martin Nekas. Two goals, two assists, and one hit. Great job for Martin and the team, but they have a lot more to keep in coverage to keep an eye on. Well, that ends it up with the first two game twos of the Flames and Oilers and Rangers against the Carolina Hurricanes. This is a lot of intense work here in between those two. And joining with me here from the next uh, part will be the Avalanche and the Wilds here at Ball Arena and then the Panthers against the Maple Leafs at the BBNT Center at Sunrise, Florida for the part of the right in the district where Miami is at. So thank you for joining us for tonight, and if you're all tuning in for the NBA playoffs, it's coming your way right up ahead here in game number five. 42 of each teams that could be going for a chance to try to pick it up where they have left it off. So thank you for watching. Until next time, peace out everyone for a while as the NHL 22 on the Stanley Cup playoffs. Thank you, and have a wonderful night in Carolina. Somebody wake up.